Okay, welcome back to another It Figures Gachapon review. I don't remember what's in this one. But uh looks like some, it's pretty big. So let's find out what we got. Seems pretty special. Uh, is it taped up? No. Well, this will be a fun surprise for all of us. I remember this now. I remember the machine. This is a Susumabachi. So in Japan, they've got giant killer wasps, which I've had the pleasure of having fly right at my head before. So there's a series of kind of insects or mushi gacha. They're pretty big. So the one I had fly at my head was about twice the size in real life. He was about the size of my thumb, but they're easy to find. Like this is this is a life size kind of small one. It's really nicely done too. Good detail, good paintwork. I like these uh, transparent wings here. That's great. They don't move or anything, but he's pretty lifelike. I think you could give someone a good scare if you set this down somewhere. You can see all his uh, stripes. Uh, it's not really a stinger. It's a little pointy. Slightly flexible plastic, but uh, yeah, that's great. Okay, cool. I don't. Ah, I think this might show the others in the series. Yeah, okay. So, what do we got here? So, there's the Suzumibachi. Oh, his head moves. Does it? Oh, uh, yeah. Would you look at that? Come on, focus up. His head can move. He can watch you and wait to attack. If uh, one of them stings you, it's not the end of the world. It'll just hurt a lot. But um, if you get a handful of them after you, and they're very aggressive, very very uh, territorial, then they can kill you. Apparently, these guys kill more people every year than all the other animals in Japan combined each year. So they're Pretty hostile, pretty dangerous. But there you go, Suzumabachi. Dangerous, that's what that sign's all about. Here we've got the Gokiburi, so the really big cockroaches that show up. Um, is this a fly or a Venus flytrap? Anyways, I guess it's the fly itself. Or is that... Oh, I guess that's supposed to be part of that. I don't know why they're showing a Venus flytrap. Maybe that's their their enemy. But yeah, we got a fly. And these are like... Uh, this one I think is like a flea. Could be wrong, but some kind of a tick or a flea. And Crablos. This guy here. Just because it says it in English right there. <laughs> so I can tell. Uh, so yeah, he'll hold on to your hair, I guess. Yeah, that must be a flea, I guess. <laughs> Anyways, very nice. That's cool. Maybe if they're still around, I'll go get another one. So thank you for watching. And uh, join me next time. Okay, bye-bye.